local seasonal and wholesome foods from Denmark, Finland, Iceland, Norway, and Sweden are the focus of the Nordic diet. It emphasizes whole grains like barley, rye, oats, berries, vegetables, fatty fish, and legumes, and is low in sweets and red meat, which is quite similar to the Mediterranean diet. So in this video, we'll discuss what is the Nordic diet? Ensure you watch to the end because the video will be simply amazing. The Baltic Sea Diet Pyramid recommends many foods that make up a healthy Nordic diet. Rapeseed oil is the principal source of fat, along with fish and low-fat dairy products included in the dietary recommendations. A Nordic diet should be low in salt, saturated fat, and added sugar. Compared with traditional Swedish food, a Nordic diet is slightly richer in proteins and carbohydrates and marginally lower in fat. Research indicates that a Nordic diet can reduce cholesterol levels and, with this, the risk of heart disease. The diet was developed by scientists at the University of Copenhagen in Denmark and the co-founder of the well-known Noma restaurant, dubbed the best restaurant in the world by some critics. It's also known as the Nordic diet on occasion. According to studies, those who follow the Nordic diet eat more essential nutrients overall than those who follow the standard Danish diet, mainly because they consume more plant-based foods, which is comparable to the typical diet in America. People who consume more anti-inflammatory and nutrient-rich foods, such as those high in fiber and polyphenol antioxidants, such as those recommended by the Nordic diet, experience more excellent protection from diseases like high blood pressure and obesity. The Nordic diet improved blood lipids and insulin sensitivity in a six-week intervention study compared to a control group. Before we continue, please support us by clicking the bell icon and subscribing to receive notifications when we upload new videos. Now let's get back to our topic. Another study found that Nordic diet adherence lowered the total mortality risk. The Nordic diet is now referred to as a healthy and appealing alternative to the regional Mediterranean diet or DASH diet by researchers. A literature review revealed that following a Nordic diet may reduce inflammation. This is fantastic news because inflammation is linked to many chronic conditions and health issues. Decreased inflammation may actually help lower the risk of type 2 diabetes, cancer, and acne, according to research. A 2015 research review showed that to a large extent diet determines whether your cells are inflamed or chilled out, and a Nordic diet could play an important role. The diet's emphasis on whole, unprocessed foods and lean proteins is strongly tied to weight loss. If you swap fish for beef, veal, or cheese, you could wind up gaining health and also potentially losing weight from this diet, says Bonnie Tobdix, RDN, creator of Better Than Dieting. And if you emphasize fruits, veggies, and whole grains more than something higher in calories and lower in nutritional value, you could lose weight because you feel more satiated. That said, Tob Dix adds that the benefits of the Nordic diet go beyond simple food choices. It's also cooking more at home, cooking with others, and making food an important part of your day instead of grab and go, she says. It's really about sharing, learning, and caring about what you're eating. In other words, the Nordic diet helps you become more mindful about eating. An additional benefit of the Nordic diet is that it is environmentally friendly. To begin with, plant-based diets use fewer natural resources like water and fossil fuels and create less pollution than diets high in meat. Eating locally grown food also consumes less energy and reduces food waste. And while the Nordic diet makes sense for those living in Northern Europe, people everywhere can apply those same principles to their diet no matter where they live. You may be familiar with the Mediterranean diet if you are familiar with the various eating plans advocated for healthy living. This diet, which is also high in seafood and includes whole grains and as much locally grown food as possible, is said to support heart health. The main distinction between this and the Nordic diet is the addition of olive oil to the Mediterranean diet. Instead, the Nordic diet emphasizes rapeseed or canola oil, also known as rapsolge in Norwegian. Growing an oil source is much simpler in a northern climate. The two oils are similar in that they contain fewer saturated fats. Although olive oil has more beneficial antioxidants, canola oil is healthier. Canola oil is also a superior cooking oil because it can withstand higher temperatures before smoking and deteriorating. Overall, both eating styles are much healthier than the high-carb, high-sugar, and high-fat Western diets may follow. The Nordic diet is newer and has been studied much less than the other, but the analysis shows little difference in the outcome. The Nordic diet experts advise allocating about an hour daily for meal preparation. This might not seem feasible for most busy families, but finding more time to cook can have significant benefits. Homemade meals are more nutritious, have fewer calories, which can make managing weight easier, and may even improve mental health because sharing meals is a social activity. This is especially true when eating with others. Aim to eat while undistracted, so you can pay attention and enjoy the meal the most. Also focus on eating until you're no longer hungry, but not to the point of being overly full. You don't have to have Viking blood to start eating like one. 
anyone can dig into this nutrient-dense cuisine. And guess what? You can keep enjoying non-Nordic flavors too. If you want to scale back inflammation, boost your heart health, and enjoy some new foods, a Nordic diet might be for you. So that's it. Please like, share, and comment below if you like this video. Remember to subscribe to watch our upcoming video. Stay safe, and we will be back soon with another video.